Chief Tui Nisinu? Is this... Momulagi? Yes. Who are you? We have come across the sea to... to keep your daughter's promise. What is this? Do you know what happened? Did you see it in the sky? Yes, but I... I still had hope. So sorry. No, it was me. I let her go. So strange. The voyage, this place, these people. It is like a dream. But it's real. It worked. His coordinates were right. Is that what you do now? You still obsess over his plan? You have to marvel at the scope of it, Oran. Hidden bank accounts and front companies, death certificates to con the public, and Trojan chips to fool his partners. Palmer was his point man, but still just a puppet. His creative accounting funneled money wherever Lear needed it. He never saw the other layers. The twin payments for embryo engineering, secret trusts for Gabriel, staged weather shift tests in the Pacific. Patterns within patterns, plans within plans. But why leave those plans for us? I would destroy any trace of them. He was too poetic. He lived in symbols like the Trinity and the Eye. Even the date he chose, December 21st, the winter equinox, the season of death, maybe a nod to the Mayan calendar. With that much thought put into it, he wanted someone to know. He wanted witnesses to spread the gospel, but he got us instead. That and a miracle. The world has changed, Remy. We heard the reports, the mournings and the celebrations, the mass disarmaments and pledges of peace. I am afraid. I am afraid they might forget. But that's where Lear had it right. Buddha and Jesus and Muhammad, they played the telephone game. Their lessons were word of mouth, their truths got diluted. A rare few experienced them, but the broadcast was different. People didn't just see it or hear it, Oran. They lived it. The system converted emotion into information. This data rode on ELF waves directly into the brains of over six billion people. It was a digital rapture. And I recorded it. The data is here. The network is live. We have the codes. They might forget Oran. But we can remind them. Like the sand, we hold the memories. She said the name of this place, that it means heaven. Is that where we are? It's beautiful. It's safe and it's warm. And in the end, I finally know. But 
I'm not alone. Go with the gods, little one. Let them lift you back to the clouds. Let them return you to the dream. I dream of a different world. A world where the old gods meet the new. Where unseen hands caress empty faces. Where all is understood. The earth will rise to embrace the air. Heaven's fire. Fragile hearts will release their burdens, vanishing like smoke and mist, and freeing the ghosts of the past. A world can be changed. dream can be real if we only 